Hello, welcome to Octagon Garage. My name is Robert. And today, well, we're not working on MGs, but we're working on a 92 Toyota Celica GT. And it needs a new power steering pump, and it had a bad high pressure side uh, power steering line. So, this has been quite the project. I've never had one of these apart before. Um, but what you have to do, or at least what I had to do, was take the CV axle out. Because the axle's in the way, the pump goes up in here. Let's see if I can get, sorry for the shaky video, but it goes up in there. And you can't get the pump out without getting the axle all the way. So in process of doing that, then we found, well, it had a bad uh, lower ball joint. So I've got the new lower ball joint. Uh, this is interesting in itself too, because it's, you know, direct replacement. And AC Delco part made in Japan. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you know, see. It's uh, made in Japan. There's the part, AC Delco part number. And uh, so, anyway, I uh, just wanted to get do a shoot, shoot a quick video on this and just show you what's going on. So, if you ever have to change a power steering pump in a 92 Toyota Celica GT, I imagine the regular Celicas are probably the same way. Um, that's what you've at least what I found what you have to do uh, I just got done flushing uh, the power steering unit so all the gunk that came out of there and I used my uh, flushing tool here hook an airline to it and run some compressed air through it and run uh, run through it like I said I've never I've worked on a few Toyotas but I'm not very well versed on them they use uh, automatic transmission fluid for power steering fluid. Did not know that. So even I learn things. Every day you learn things. So, oh, and the other thing too, I cleaned up the reservoir. Sorry for the loud motorcycles. I cleaned up the reservoir. It looks really good, but I need to find the bracket that holds that retains this against the firewall. Uh, there was no bracket, so it was just sitting there. So, for now, it's going to get replaced back in there how it was. And I find a bracket, then I'll be able to pop it in there. It won't be a big deal. So, anyway, y'all have a nice day, and see you later. Bye-bye.